and I'll get back to you later. You bring over some hot dog buns, and we'll have a good time. All right, Benji, you gotta train a new guy. Hello? Man, how come you gotta give me diaper duty? what I do wrong? I done told you once I had enough of that yip yap. Now you get work. Man, alright, whatever. Come on, giddy up, cowboy. You ever drove a bulldozer before? No. Well, how about a forklift? Nope. What about a dirt bike? No. What about an 18 wheeler? Uh uh. Airplane? No. Cement mixer? No. Lawnmower? Nope. Scissor lift? No. Moped? Yeah, actually, I drew the moped. I mean, this ain't actually nothing like a moped. I don't know why I said that. Table saw? Um, no. Band saw? No. Miter saw? Nope. Seesaw? No. Blender? No. Weed whacker? Nope. Toothpaste? No. Toothpick? No. Apple pie? Uh uh. Football? Um, no. Well, we got a little bit of problemo here. I mean, since it's being that you ain't know how to drive nothing, we about have to start on page one. First thing you gotta do, check make sure there's gasoline in the engine. Uh, we got about a full tank. Right, there's gasoline in the bulldozer engine. But what about in our engine right here, if you catch my gastronomical drift? What do you mean? You ever been to Frankenberg? No, what's Frankenberger? All right, man, you're about to start learning. This is a perfect lesson for day one. Today we're going to talk about the new, the order new. Uh, we're looking for a location. What we're going to do is we're going to purpose the Bermuda Triangle as an ideal. I've got one word here, alacrity. That's what I think we need to follow through with. Cloak and dagger if we must. <laughs> it might be Oceana's property, technically. Once we have it under our belt, we will be uh, centralized. You have my attention. Please continue. Welcome to a freaking bag. What do you want to eat? Uh, let me get. Oh god, what do I want to eat? Um, let me see. What do I want to eat? Mm -hmm. Let me get. I'm gonna go for them burritos. Let me get two of them. All right, make that two. I'll just have a Franken fry. No. Sorry about that. This is his first day on the job. He don't know left from right from wrong. He's gonna need those burritos. Por favor. I can't eat all that. Look, man, you're going to need the energy. Trust me. I could eat all that. <sighs> it might be hard work, but it's part of the job. If you want to be a bulldozing boy, you got to do your best. If you want an easy way, go over to Dose Pros. They're lazy, they can't drive. You don't want to work at a place like that. You want to do your best. You want to be a bulldoze ink boy. Yeah, okay. Hey, you two bums know I ain't paid to listen to this. Oh yeah, man, what's up, Will? What do you little geezers want? Hey, Benji, come over here. Oh, hey, Ted. Yeah, how you doing? Ted, this is Bert. Bert, Ted. Ted does electrical. You know, we'll see him working on the same construction site all the time. So he best get to know him. Well, nice to meet ya. Hey, Benji, watch this. Hello. <laughs> the burger talk to me. Alright, man, that's cool. We're gonna go sit down and eat now. Hello? 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 I'm calling on behalf of GovCorp. We're actually looking for someone who could design a golf course. Oh, hey, GovCorp. <laughs> I love it when you guys call. We're going to need the designs for a golf course. Yeah, actually, I'm working on an auditorium right now, but wait a second. Y'all never gave me my money for the last time. I never got a check. We're GovCorp. You can trust us. The designs would need to include an 18-hole golf course, a clubhouse, and a gazebo. Oh, good. And you want a gazebo? Okay. Oh, the clubhouse. Oh, I like designing a clubhouse. And 
how are you going to pay me? When, um, actually, how I got paid for, yeah, for the last thing. I never got paid. I can assure you, the financial factor will be evaluated. I don't see no rainbow, but I sure do see a pot of gold. I don't think you're supposed to go in there. Technically, if you want to get nitpicky about it, I mean, this ain't really part of the job. But you know what, man? You ain't got to tell nobody. Alright man, score. Let's get on. As Prime Minister of Oceana, you must be interested in what fellow leaders call the Order New. Nah, I haven't heard of the Order New, but I'll tell you what, I am bloody interested. Yeah, I haven't won the election though yet, so I'm not technically PM. I have made a contribution to a major television network. An announcement of your win, regardless of the votes, will broadcast. This is the only legitimate way to appoint a politician. You see, this system of politics is based on one person trusting another rather than letting inept civilians complicate and degrade the polls with their lack of morale and congruence. Ian, you reckon that'll work, mate? You know people you trust that much, do you? Like clockwork. Well, the fact that the world is controlled by a few people who trust the likes of myself is pretty bloody stellar news. Good burger, Anna Burgers. Hello, corporate golf packages, eh? Quite right. As a PM, you are invited to be an elite member of the Order New. Do you accept? Mate, let me put it like this. From now on, until I win the election, I can only make campaign promises, can I? You know how worthless those are. Good show. Ha <laughs> ha. Hmm. All right, let's order some tucker. Please. Welcome to a Four Zenith. What kind of art you guys want to indulge in tonight? All of the, uh, uh, yes, truth, this sounds bonza. Yeah, the giraffe egg on canvas, meta-narrative, interdisciplinary, 1973. Yeah, right, sound uh, delicious. And uh, what'll it be for you? Ostrich horn marrow, tempera on linen, 1984. We'll have the cask wine. Cheapest one you got. Styrofoam cups, thanks, chief. Jackson Pollock style, if my memory serves me right. You are quite cultured, Rondo. Yeah, nah. If it wasn't for art and its beautiful ability to create meaningless conversation, people might actually notice we're money launderers. The next time we dine, it will be in the grand room, and I will introduce you to the big dogs. There you will meet a lobby, which is a law written by a corporation that you introduced to Oceana's parliament. It is the least corporations can do, help you with your new work as lawmaker, and give additional financial warmth to your low-paying job as PM. Yeah, sounds tops, mate. Tough living on Decker Pharma Trust funds I inherited alone. <clears throat> I always had a tickle for a little more nickel. Hey, mate. Oh, cool, this looks yummo. Alright, boys, laham. Quite an exceptional art piece, circa 1984. No mistake there. Alright, male, um, could you hold on? Just like a second, I gotta run over there. What's up, little man? How about you go run along and get me goose tape? What's the goose tape? You know goose tape. Goose tape's that stuff we use so Mr. Turtle don't run away. Oh, that's the goose tape. 
Og gav for øjnene. Kom <laughs> on, let's go show Benito. Hey, brother. Hey, Benito, man, you got... Hold on a second, watch this. Hey, Junior, where's the goose type? I can't find her. <laughs> oh man, that's good. Hey Benji, how come you got a hammer in your hand? Oh yeah, dude, come over here. I want to show you my new project. Yeah, it kind of look like a um a ladder. Yeah, dude, that that's what it's for. You know, like getting up in a tree or you know climbing on top of a roof. I don't know. Any kind of time you want to just get high. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, <laughs> that sounds good. <laughs> Let's go try it out. Upsie daisy. Holy mackerel. Dibs on pinball. We're gonna lay down the rules, that way we don't get surprised later. Double deuce, double double back, middle ring, double dutch, no Charlie Temple, corporate backing, all good, ready me throwing this. Uh huh. Oh, good shot. <laughs> Loser has to take a shot, winner has to take three. Here we go. Yeah, that's about five. Mm hmm. Oh, good throw, man. Yeah, man, that was good. That's about three. Okay. <laughs> Who win? Let me check. Uh, five against three. That's or uh, five is greater than three. That means Benji you won. Oh, that's me. I won. Well, it looks like I won. Maybe next time, though, man. You could really lose track of time in here. Yeah, time all weird in here. Kinda like you're hibernating. <laughs> I kinda slipped the continuum, man. We could have been in here for days and I wouldn't even have recognized. We need like a, a watch or a, uh, a clock or a calendar or something in here. Oh, well, maybe sundial. Hey, Benito. What if we got a moon dial? That would be cool. I'm going to go get some spoons. Hello. Benji, I'm going to need you to go on a business trip. Oh, man, I'm real sorry. I'd like to go, but I got a real bad case of a sweet tooth. Looks like your luck changed for the worse. You're going to Bermuda Triangle. But, boss, come on. Stick that butt in an ashtray and get up on that heli. You got about two minutes before departure.
got a bottle over there. You want to open it up for me? Alright man, we're ready down here. Commence gazebo drop. They're a little kid, they don't know what they're doing, you know. You missed it by a long shot, man. Keep your eye on the road. Alright, little boo-boo, so what? Anybody can make a mistake. And that should be the cherry on the top. Uh, uh, Bert? Is, is that you, man? Um, uh, yeah, it's me. What are you doing here, man? You told me to wait here. Oh, man, I'm, I'm sorry, man. I've been in a Bermuda Triangle. Man, you got a real good sense of patience. I admire that. I got good news for you, buddy. We're done for today. Uh, okay. You're gonna be a great bulldoze ink boy. You know that. Alright, man. I'll see you tomorrow. You take care now, alright? Sweet winks. See you tomorrow. Sweet slapstick lullaby. That is some patience. I'm home! Holy water, what are you doing, home? I gotta get ready. Think he made you some pasta. Oh man, you make me some pasta. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> That's so sweet of you. Dinky, how come this is all green? Because I threw out all the red and yellow, because the green is your favorite color. Green is my favorite color. Oh, yeah, it is. Thank you, darling. Oh, no. Are you okay, little man? Why are you running around with tape on your head? Kind of dumb. <laughs> Oh man, I want you to do the joke. Come here, Junior. You're gonna have a road with a lot of people smiling. There's gonna be some bumps, man. So you be careful, okay? Yeah. You know, that was really funny. Benito liked that joke too, didn't he? Yeah, I'm a funny guy. At first, this ribbon cutting may seem futile, a charade perhaps, but no, I am here physically to share this moment, and physically sharing is no futile feat. Soon the Order New will introduce global currency, as value in old currencies will not carry over, we will bring an end to inheritance. Savings will diminish as the new currency naturally deteriorates, and we will no longer deal in quantities, but a spectrum of colors. Let this leveling plane be a reckoning to the creative souls lying dormant. 
let those eager to adapt flourish, and we will begin to work for something more than good. Let us work for something beautiful. Oh yeah, Bert, I want to introduce you to my kid. His name's Benji. My dog name is Benji, just like me. My name's Bert. Nice to meet you. Now your dad's going to teach me how to drive a bulldozer. How about we get some brewskis? Junior, what you want to drink? Oh, you know what sounds good? Junior ginger beer. All right, we're good to go. But, um... Oh man, no, don't worry about it. It's all me. Uh, actually... So, how'd you like the first day of work? Yeah, there's a lot of things I want to learn, but, I mean, overall, it's good. You you do it day after day, you get used to it, you learn the strings, you know which ones to pull, and which ones to stay away from, and which strings need a scissors. But overall, it's, it's a pretty good job, I'd say. Yeah, I'm learning. I got the drinks. Thank you, little man. But, um, actually, I don't drink. Oh, don't worry about that, man. I'll drink it for you. I mean, what are friends for? I'm spicy. <laughs> man, isn't he the greatest? Hey, everybody. Let's do a cheers. All right, this is to Bert and uh, hope and cheers that he have a good future working at Bulldozing. Hold up, where'd my beer go? I can't find it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like funny. <laughs>